There are four powerful tools you can use when reviewing student pages in OneNote class notebooks. Let's see how you can use them to help grade and provide detailed feedback to your students. Instead of having to click on each individual student folder, you can use the built-in review tool. However, for the tool to work, you must use the distribute page feature to ensure that each student has the page which needs to be marked in a specific common folder. To use it, click on the class notebook tab and select review student work. On this panel screen, select the student section the student work is located in and click Next. We now need to select the correct page you would like to mark and then click Next. You can now visit each student's page with just one click. You can even lock each student page to prevent the students from adding or editing their work while you review it. If you do not want the students to edit their work after you have finished marking their work, keep the pages locked. If you wish to unlock them, you will need to select the lock pages link again to enable the students to edit their work. If you have a touch device and a stylus pen, you can use the draw tab tools to add comments or highlight areas in the student work. Click on the draw tab on the top ribbon to display the options. You can now choose which type of drawing tool you would like to use and the color of the digital ink. You can now use this tool to write comments on the work or highlight work. You can use the ink in further to help students focus on certain areas by using the audio recording tool. For example, you can record your feedback orally and at the same time highlight areas of the student work. Then when the student plays the audio back, they'll be able to hear and see which section of the work you are referring to. You have a really good understanding of the processes that are occurring. What I really like is the fact that you've included key terms. What will be even better is if you can include some more information here about what the light energy is being used for by the plant. This has been an effective way to provide detailed feedback to students, but also save time when you have to mark a lot of assignments. A nice way to provide feedback or encouragement is using the customizable stickers. You can add stickers anywhere on the page to provide the student with a message such as praising them for excellent work. To add the stickers, you need to click on the insert tab on the ribbon and then click on the stickers icon. This will display all the available built-in stickers that you can use. 
select one which you would like to use and then write a custom message to the student. Click on one of the options here to enhance your teaching and learning and don't forget to subscribe to the Teach Me channel so you know when more useful videos are released.